Hi guys, welcome to this video. In this video we'll be looking at expanding the brackets the quick way. So our previous tutorial we had a look at expanding the brackets with rectangles. So this method is only a shortcut of what we did with the rectangle dissection where we had a look at the area of the rectangles. So this method will be uh, more time um, savvy and also less effort. So in our previous video we had a look at the expansion of this particular binomial product and we had a look at it by um, looking at rectangles but also a longer method. So the quick method says that we look at this first term multiplied by this term the first term again multiplied by the second term in the second brackets and that will give us x times x which is x squared x times negative 3 which is negative 3x then we multiply the second term in the first brackets by the first term in the second brackets and then the second term in the first brackets by the second term in the second brackets which will give us 4x and 4 times negative 3 is negative 12. We can simplify our two middle terms again to get positive 1x. So we have x squared plus 1x take away 12. So again you can look at the bunny ears so he's got the bunny ears so they kind of look like bunny ears so if you want to remember it like that, you can. Alright, using this method, let's expand this set of brackets. So pause the video, have a go at using our um, quick way to see what we get in our expansion. Okay, so our first two terms would be the product of that and the product of those two. So that gives us 6a squared and that gives us 3a times 4 and negative 2 times positive 2a will give us something and negative 2 times positive 4 remember we're multiplying so that gives us negative 4a and that gives us negative 8 simplify our two middle terms and we have 6a squared plus 8a take away 8. Okay, pause the video, answer these two questions using the bunny loop ears or our quick ex um, expansion, and we'll mark our work as soon as we check our answers. Okay, so m times m is m squared, m times negative 6 negative 6m negative 2 times m negative 2m negative 2 times negative 6 double negative when you multiply those two double negatives you get positive and 2 6 is a 12 these two middle terms simplify to negative 8m there's your m squared there's your 12 alright our last binomial expansion is 3m times positive 6, 3m times 6 is 18m, and 3m times negative 2m is negative 6m squared. Negative 4 times 6, negative 24. Negative 4 times negative 2m is a positive 8m. So we can simplify this term and this term to give us 24m, sorry that's a 26m, and we have these two terms remaining. So 26m take away 6m squared take away 24 and there's our final answer. Thanks for watching this tutorial.